everyone. Welcome to Off the Hook on the Plate. My name is Josie Lanzi, and you know it. It's another beautiful day here in the sunshine state of Florida, and I'm going to take you out fishing with me. Hopefully, bring home that fresh catch of the day and create yet another Off the Hook recipe. So let's get fishing so we can come back here and get cooking. Well, we're just backing out. We're going to head down the channel here, South Channel, and head out. We're going to go to our favorite spot way out there about 30 miles out and uh, we're going to test out that spot a little bit better today and hopefully we come home with that catch of the day so I'll see you guys when we get there. Well we're here and it's going to be time to get fishing. We threw our marker out there. We found this new spot last uh, week with some kind of ledge so hopefully we'll do good today. So uh, we got plenty of bait now. We got plenty of pinfish and baby grunts. The usual sardine frozen and frozen squid so uh, let's get fishing and real look at this fat grunt it's the size of a snapper almost you know we're gonna keep this one nice start dropping rail so far yeah I got the day it's not too little but it's certainly not big enough to keep there it goes well I'm gonna send down a little penny here a little pinfish cuz uh, Brent had something really big and it cut his line I mean that that pole was bent in half something big down there whoop we got one alive <laughs> all right it's gonna go down another red well there's plenty of them but they're too short so far today I put that one back again sheesh Brent just got check it out look at a huge hog snapper you know those are good Check it out, check it out. I love it. You know you're putting that in the co in the cooler. I'm gonna throw them back. No, put it in cooler. Okay. All right, today with our beautiful catch of the day, and today was a hogfish, and you know that's from the snapper family. So if you don't have hogfish in your area, you certainly can substitute with snapper. To this, we're only gonna season with sea salt on both sides. Like I always say, fresh fish doesn't need a whole lot. And we're going to set this aside and create a beautiful sauce. Okay, I'm going to make for you what I call an orange rosemary picante broiled hogfish. So let's get started. It's super easy. Quarter cup of orange marmalade. A tablespoon of prepared horseradish and a teaspoon of fresh chopped rosemary, pinch of salt, cracked black pepper, also about a pinch, and mix well. In addition, you do want to add a tiny bit of lime juice. So I have a few wedges here, and we don't need a whole lot. You want to go ahead and just squeeze the juice. That equal approximately one tablespoon in lime juice, and that's just perfect. Mix, and we'll go ahead and coat our hogfish. All right, we want to add our rosemary orange picante glaze on both sides of the fish. Make sure it's well coated. Set my oven on broil to get it preheated and coated on one side my hogfish okay now you want to top the other side okay broil your fish for 8 to 12 minutes okay plate your hogfish and with the remaining of the sauce you want to drizzle around your plate just like so. And garnish with a lime wedge. And voila, yet another off the hook recipe. Another fabulous fun trip. I had a blast sharing my fishing trip with you and sharing yet another off the hook on the plate recipe. Do me a favor, leave me a comment. I love to hear from you. Try that recipe out. I guarantee you're going to love it. So I'll see you back here next week for another off the hook, on the plate recipe. Bye, everyone.